I look like I just woke up or either just got released from prison. I'm having this ugly weed. It is definitely giving pilgrim. We're Escape, and this is our hair story. Oh, <laughs> my goodness. I had like a whole bunch of hairdos happening in one. I had bangs, I had curls. It was like pulled up in a ponytail or something. It was a lot happening. I got front. curls in the front with a ponytail in the back. And then your eyebrows was doing its own hairstyle. Girl, my eyebrows are so thick. Connecting. I got a half bang. I look a hot mess. Like I'm about to take wings and fly. I was very good at doing my own hair. Like I used to know how to put my crimps in it. I yeah. could press it. At one point I called myself coloring. I was just putting oh peroxide my in my hair and going out in the sun and letting it lighten up. I look a hot mess. I don't know who did it. I can't even remember that far, but whoever did it don't need to do it no more. Girl. Dun, da, da, da. Ciao. That was when we first, first came out. Oh, yeah. We were super young. Yeah, I definitely feel like we were just on the road and doing it ourselves. Hence the bandana. I used to just have a, a bob. So I used to just wrap it and then at night and go to sleep and then comb it down and throw that bandana on it. I look like I just woke up or either just got released from prison. I had a Chinese bang and a ponytail. Simple. All right, now don't play with us right here. Oh, yeah, I thought I was killing it. I had the hat on backwards with my bob. Like, my bob was everything to me back then. I thought that bob was the best bob to ever hit the streets. Yeah, I had just some, you know, cornrows, braids to the back. I was braiding my own hair at the time, as you can see. Oh, oh. Why did we wear that to the Billboard Music Awards? I got a good bun up at the top with a swoop bang. You were pregnant at the time. Oh, yeah. My hair was like in a weird phase. It was short and it was growing out at that point. You can tell my hair was short because you see the black and then it's the color. Like, they should have just gave me all black. I don't know why they did that. I know what's the matter at everybody's hair right here. That was when you had the little blind front. Remember? Yeah. The strip. And to me, you had I like. I had a ponytail. With some pin curls. With pin curls. I won't go into the prom. <laughs> I know Tamika Scott used to wear this damn Mickey Mouse hair. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I was about to talk about. Y'all yeah, better leave my Mickey Mouse hairstyle. I, I love it. You would never get rid of it. Buns. That's right. And yeah. she refused to remove them for the Feel So Good video. I'm glad I listened. telling her, uh-uh, you are not wearing that. And she argued with them, but she finally let them take it out. And then they put some, like, weave, and she had, like, a straight mid limp hair type of look. It and was it sexy. Was so it was, cute. Yes, it was. I definitely know that going into the second album when I had cut my hair off, that haircut was inspired by Mary J. Blige. Because I believe it was like on the My Life album when she had the blonde hair that was like short. Yeah, I was pretty much a trendsetter with this hair color and stuff because, you know, I started with the black hair and then I went from like trying to go blonde, but it didn't really take because my hair was black. So it was like blonde pieces in the front and it kind of got like a reddish brown and then like a dark brown. Keisha Cole and other people started doing hair color like that. I didn't know if I wanted to wear braids one minute, wear my Mickey Mouse ears another oh, minute. <laughs> We probably could have did without some of them, but those were the times, so now I'm really regretting none. Don't play with her. <laughs> <laughs> Don't play with them. We had this safari look working it, okay? Yes. <laughs> Cheetah girls. I mean, I wasn't really mad at my hair. That was like the thing where they used to do the like hair sprouts. Yeah. So for me, I just colored my hair and curled it, made it straight, you know. I kept it safe with my braids and my cowgirl hats. Them braids had some curls on the end, yeah, girl, and they is hard. Yeah, <laughs> Look at these big old curls. Let me see. Girl, girl. that's like a bush down there curl. I had lightened my bob a little bit. It was cool. I had like a orangey blonde hair color. I kind of love this color. Put my hair in two pigtails with a little swoop bang, you know. Yeah, like y'all going to the club, me and my sister like, we're going to church. <laughs> I was going through it right here, girl. I was Sister Tamika on this picture. Sister Praise the Lord. <laughs> you actually was acting like Sister Tamika. I was too. <laughs> you had got born again around right, that time. Right, I did, I did. We definitely were on two different pages. Two different planets, girl. Yeah. I just had my hair curly, big and curly. I like this look. Doing hair back then was way easier than now. Like, now it's all about the wigs, whereas back in the 90s, 
a lot of people didn't wear a lot of weave. You know, it was yeah. mainly people were wearing their real hair and styling their real hair. Even though we were in a group, we were very different from each other. Like we all had our own taste and they were all very much different. <laughs> <laughs> even till today, even today is different. Yeah, it's, it's hard still. to sometimes, you know, get one look because everybody wants something different. At this point, I did start adding tracks to my hair. So in here, I did have some weave. I was changing, experimenting more with my hair. Whereas before, like in the 90s, I was definitely not into like the weave and the all of that, I was more so just like the bob or the shortcut or whatever. So right here, this is a, a Halloween party that I was at. That uh, was a Halloween party? Yeah. Maybe it wasn't a Halloween party. It was Toya's party, though. Oh, that was the pimp and hoes party. Yeah, exactly. You so, was a hoe. Yeah, I was trying to be a hoe. I was trying to be a hoe, but it was still a classy hoe. I just went back to my first days, back to black. Girl, I was a whole eight and a half months pregnant. But I still have the same black nails. So 30 years of wearing your fingernails black. I love it. I love it. Because when it chips, you can't tell. Look, I need to fill in. Y'all can't even tell, can you? Girl, oh, please don't show me this. I think they sabotaged yeah, me on purpose. 2017, we got back together after not performing together with all four of us for like over a decade. You know, everybody had their own look and different things they wanted to do. As far as my hair, I was just really like shoulder length, part on the side. I had on this ugly wig. You were look at it. Wig. I was washed out. And why do I got on this color jumpsuit and everybody got on black? Cause you always was trying to stand out. Mm, that's us. a lie, y'all. Yeah. Girl, so every time you got so dressed at that point, it's you had an outfit that was totally <laughs> different. Embellished from way else. more than ours. It was another wig I was supposed to have, but he didn't bring it. So he just threw this on my head, and it's not. You can just go. No, right back here. He didn't even try to even pull it up. I think they did that on purpose. But this picture right here. Yeah. <laughs> Let's talk about this picture. Come on, yes, uh, we look good right there. We were singing uh, Understand It, BT Works. Yes, 2017, yeah. BT Yes. Oh, oh, drum roll. <laughs> this was at the Soul Train Awards 2022. I decided I was going to do something more Afrocentric, do more kinky, curly hair with the braid crown. Tamika, this color is cute on you. Thank you. I had a, um, what you call it, a sew-in, like a, um, yeah, oh, a wig. A quick weave is what it's called. We won the Lady of Soul Award that day and um, we were getting to perform. It really was an amazing night. This year, 2023 is our 30th, 30th anniversary. Year. Our group came out in 1993. Mm -hmm. So this is a big anniversary for us. We have a lot of performances coming up that we're looking forward to. Oh my gosh, let me see. What would I bring back? I'll probably bring back my shortcut. I bring back either the finger waves, this good thing, or the flips. I've already brought back a style from the 90s. Y'all see this swoop? Yeah, that's from the 90s, baby. This swoop and a little curl at the end with the ponytail. Uh, we back. <laughs> we back. We're Escape, and this has been our hair story. story.